So a couple days ago, you guys probably saw that my entire YouTube channel got hacked. I just want to start off by saying sorry. Once these guys got into my account, I couldn't do anything. And because of that, you guys were exposed to this weird crypto scam live stream on my channel. So because of that, I am super, super sorry. If you guys keep up with YouTube much at all, this probably isn't the first time you've seen this kind of a hack happen on a YouTube channel because unfortunately it's not super uncommon. These guys have been hacking YouTube channels for a while now. Um, some big boys like MC Creamy, uh, Castro, not even a day after I was hacked, a YouTuber by the name of, sorry, a YouTuber by the name of Scooby was hacked by the exact same people and they did the same thing to him. At this moment in time, I have gotten access back to my YouTube channel, but you'll probably notice that all of the videos and all the content is completely deleted. So as soon as these guys got into my YouTube account, which happened in under a minute, um, they got in and completely changed all of my two-factor security before my phone could even notify me that they were doing anything. So as soon as they got in, they completely deleted everything off of my channel. They changed their name to this Tesla cryptocurrency scam thing. And then they started their live stream that shows like Elon Musk talking about crypto or something. I honestly had no idea what to do. Uh, my first thought was to get somebody on the phone and maybe point me in the right direction. Unfortunately, it seems Google doesn't really have anything like that. The only phone number that I could find just sent me to this stupid bot that just kept on putting me in a circle to the account recovery page. So it didn't help at all. So that's when I decided to watch some of the videos of other YouTubers who were hacked by these guys explaining what they did. And pretty much every person that I watched said they did the same thing. And that was go and cry to YouTube on Twitter. It seems like with a lot of the issues on YouTube, going and crying to YouTube on Twitter is actually one of the only ways to get it resolved. So that's what I did. I, I went and I added them and I DM them on Twitter and I had all my followers retweet to make sure they saw it. And it took, I think, four hours for them to finally reply to me, which is almost exactly how long it took MC Creamy for him to get a reply from them as well. At that point, they completely terminated the channel so that the live stream that was trying to scam people wasn't going on anymore. And they also deactivated my Gmail because that's actually what got hacked is my Gmail that was linked to my YouTube. So where we're at now, I have access to my email again. I have access to my YouTube, but YouTube still is talking to me about hopefully getting all of my content back. I've heard mixed things. I've heard a lot of people were able to get all their videos back and whatnot. And I've heard other people were not. Uh, I'm really, really hoping I can get all my stuff back because that would be probably about 10 years of my career basically just gone. Uh, the channel also lost thousands of subscribers, but I totally do not blame those guys for unsubscribing. I mean, when you see a notification from my channel and it's some stupid cryptocurrency scam, I don't blame you for unsubscribing. And unfortunately, at this time, uh, I do not know for sure how this happened. I've had people telling me a bunch of different things. The most common thing that I've seen is that it is potentially from a phishing link. So I might have clicked on a link that looked completely normal, but wasn't. And through that link, they were able to get through all of my two factor without my phone, like even knowing it. Thankfully, I've had a lot of people tell me uh, some steps I can take to better secure my account, and I will definitely be doing that so that hopefully this never happens again. Some of it seems very unrealistic for people who don't do this for a living, because one of the biggest things was to have a completely different computer purely for clicking on any links that I have to click on for business reasons. It's actually pretty sad when I tweeted at YouTube with this issue I had a lot of people in my mentions on that tweet who aren't necessarily YouTubers that do this for a living that are having the exact same issue and they can't get any help from YouTube. So it seems like this is a massive issue right now. Um, this is definitely not the last time you're going to see these people hack channels. 
really the best advice that I can give is to do literally everything you can when it comes to security on your email. If you don't already for sure have two factor authenticators, you can have the app, you can have your phone number, backup email, all of it. So that is where we are right now. I wanted to wait a little bit longer until YouTube got back to me about potentially being able to bring back the videos on my channel, but I thought it just made more sense to update you guys as soon as possible. I've been updating everybody on Twitter and on my Discord, but I know a lot of people don't follow those. So I wanted to get on here and just explain everything as soon as I could. So once again, dudes, I'm super sorry about all of this. It is just a super stressful and annoying situation. I'll be keeping everybody up to date on the YouTube community page, on my Twitter, on my Discord, all of that stuff with whatever YouTube brings forward when it comes to my videos and whatnot and the rest of the channel. Anyways, guys, thank you for sticking with me through all of this. I hope you have an amazing rest of the day and I'll see you in the next one. See you later.